The Untold Story of Afghanistan's Economic Revolution Through Mega Projects After more than six decades of turmoil, instability and conflict, Afghanistan is charting a new course towards economic revival, fueled by a series of ambitious mega projects. With international aid and a fresh emphasis on infrastructure development, these endeavors are set to redefine the nation's future, bringing about tangible improvements in the lives of its citizens and generating valuable job opportunities. Here are some of the noteworthy mega projects that underscore Afghanistan's journey towards a robust economy and modern infrastructure. So, join us for an in-depth look at some of the most significant mega projects currently under construction in Afghanistan, highlighting their potential impact on the country's economic stability and regional significance. For more videos like this, be sure to subscribe to Ultimate Mega Builds. And now, let's delve into the details. First up is the Kabul New City Project. Following the Taliban's fall in 2002, around 3 million Afghan expatriates returned to their homeland, causing a significant surge in Kabul's population. From its original capacity of 700,000 in 1980, the city's inhabitants have skyrocketed to over 4.95 million in 2023, resulting in critical overpopulation issues and a concerning deterioration of living conditions. In response, the Afghan government initiated a bold solution – the construction of a new city at Dasabs, north of Kabul, spanning 40,000 hectares and envisions to house more than 3 million residents over time. This ambitious Kabul New City project unfolds in two phases, with the first phase focusing on erecting the new city across approximately 1,275 hectares. The second phase involves the revitalization of downtown Kabul, collectively aiming to alleviate the strain caused by overpopulation. The estimated cost hovers around $15 billion, with funding pouring in from significant contributors such as the World Bank, the United States, Japan, and the Dasab City Development Authority, or DCDA. This substantial financial backing fuels the project, anticipating to yield a minimum of 12,000 housing units, generate over a million jobs, and establish a high-quality environment conducive to education, employment, commerce, and numerous other activities. The Kabul New City Project stands as a beacon of hope, not only for addressing overpopulation challenges, but also for fostering a vibrant and sustainable urban future for the people of Kabul. Up next is the Half Herat Railway. Afghanistan's pivotal location at the crossroads of China, Iran, Pakistan and Central Asian states positions it as a linchpin in regional connectivity. The Half Herat Railway Project clearly illustrates this as the government is building a 225-kilometer cross-border railway linking eastern Iran to western Afghanistan. This railway project assumes critical importance as the core within the proposed $2 billion Five Nations Railway Corridor, or FNRC, an ambitious 2,000-kilometer network interlinking Iran, Afghanistan, Tajikistan, Kyrgyzstan and China. The Half Herat Railway spans from Herat to the Afghan-Tajik border, journeying through Tajikistan and eventually traversing Kyrgyzstan, creating a vital regional artery. A significant portion, totaling 140 kilometers, cuts through Afghanistan, while the remaining 85 kilometers stretch through Iran. As this mega project unfolds, it not only enhances Afghanistan's connectivity, but also contributes to the broader vision of fostering economic ties across the entire region. While the first three sections of the railway, situated in Iran, were inaugurated in December 2020, the construction of the Half Herat Line began back in 2007, boasting a reported value of $75 million entirely funded by Iran. This railway initiative is poised to bring about substantial benefits, notably reducing shipping costs, alleviating border traffic congestion, and promoting the seamless transportation of both passengers and goods throughout the region. Beyond its economic impact, the project is anticipated to generate job opportunities and enhance living standards for the local population. With an annual capacity to transport 6 million tons of goods and 1 million passengers, the Half Herat Railway project emerges as a catalyst for progress, fostering regional cooperation and economic growth. Moving on, we have the Kosh Tapa Canal. The Kosh Tapa Canal stands as a monumental infrastructure project in northern Afghanistan, strategically designed to redirect water from the Amu Darya River 
to irrigate a vast expanse of approximately 55,000 hectares in Georgian and Faryab provinces. This extensive canal, spanning 280 kilometers in length and 100 meters in width, is the brainchild of the Afghanistan National Development Company, with the collaborative efforts of 120 private companies and a workforce comprising around 2,300 individuals. The project's significance for Afghanistan cannot be overstated. Its primary objective is to transform arid landscapes into fertile farmlands, focusing on the cultivation of grains and wheat. The ultimate ambition is to position the country as a wheat exporter by 2028, ushering in prosperity for over a million people in the process. Initiated in 2022, the construction of the Kosh Tapa Canal reached a milestone with the completion of its first phase in October 2023 swiftly followed by the commencement of the second phase. Despite its noble goals, the project has encountered skepticism and apprehension from independent experts and engineers. Questions surrounding the Afghan government's capacity to effectively execute the canal project have been raised, citing reported shortages in skilled personnel and adequate machinery, potentially posing long-term challenges. Nevertheless, despite the challenges and debates, the completion of the Kosh Tapa Canal is anticipated to bring about a significant transformation in the agricultural landscape of northern Afghanistan, offering potential improvements in food security and economic prospects for the region. Lastly, we have the Turkmenistan Afghanistan Pakistan India, or TAPI, pipeline project. Positioned as a transformative endeavor, its mission is to transport natural gas from Turkmenistan's Galkanish gas field to Afghanistan, Pakistan, and India. Spanning an impressive 1,600 kilometers, this pipeline is designed to deliver a maximum of 33 billion cubic meters of natural gas annually over a 30-year period. Beyond being a conduit for energy, TAPI envisions itself as a crucial link fostering regional integration and catalyzing economic growth among the participating nations. For Afghanistan, the TAPI project represents more than just a pipeline. It offers a reliable source of energy that stands to invigorate the country's economy, lessening its dependence on imported energy and contributing to enhanced energy security. This initiative unfolds in two distinct phases, with the initial phase dedicated to constructing the pipeline segments in Afghanistan and Pakistan. The comprehensive project scope encompasses procurement, installation, and operation of the pipeline and its related facilities within these two countries. The subsequent phase involves the construction of the India section, creating a holistic network that not only facilitates energy transport, but also generates opportunities for new grid connections, fortifying regional market prospects. Envisioned as a catalyst for positive change, the TAPI pipeline project is anticipated to bring about job opportunities and elevate living standards in the region. Commencing its construction journey in 2015 with an estimated cost of $10 billion, the project faced hurdles along the way, including significant supply chain issues. As of now, the pipeline is not yet fully operational, extending beyond its initially projected completion date of 2021. But despite these challenges, the TAPI gas pipeline project remains a beacon of promise, poised to reshape the energy landscape and promote economic prosperity across Afghanistan, Pakistan and India. As these transformative megaprojects unfold, there emerges a glimmer of hope for Afghanistan's future. After enduring over six decades of turmoil, instability and wars, the nation is at a turning point, charting a course towards a robust economy and infrastructure. So, what are your thoughts on these groundbreaking projects? Can the Afghan government overcome challenges and turn these visions into reality? Comment below and please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more videos like this. Until next time, stay curious.